Good morning. How's it going? Good, you alright? Yeah, do you mind if I ask you why I got pulled over? Yeah, you're all over the road. You're straddling the lane, you're leaving the lane lines, you made a sharp turn over there that looked kind of like it snuck up on you. Oh. Would you, you have any medical problems at all? No, I don't. How's the truck working? Fine. Alright, where are you coming from? Um, I'm heading home. I just got to a new address. Okay, you have a routine. You have, um... Look, I'm going to be honest with you, officer. Um, I just finished probation, and I'm, I'm starting a program, and um, I'm getting a hardship. So is this valid? Um, that is actually... Um, this is you, right? It's me. It's valid, but it's not um, up to date. What does that mean? Um, what's the correct word for this? It's not, um, I need to renew it. So it just expired? Expired. When did it expire? Um, I believe in June or July I've been needing to fix this. Well, when's your birthday? March 13th. Typically that's when it expires on your birthday. But, okay. <clears throat> I mean, listen, officer, I live two blocks from here. Okay. Well, I just want to make sure you're safe. I want to make sure you're not having any medical problems the way you're driving. I don't want you crash and hurt yourself or somebody else, right? Understandable. You have insurance on the vehicle? I do. Can I see it? Anybody else in here? No. Whose car is this? It's my mother's. I'd have to get a hold of her. I don't know if I have a copy of it on me. Okay. All right. Um, which company is it? Um, it's Geico. Do you have maybe an app on your phone? Um, I don't have the app on my phone. Okay. All right. Um, is there a way, you, I mean, you think she, you can get a hold of her now? I can try. Um, um, Give it a try. What, what is it to hurt, you know? Look, I have, I know that I'm in the wrong For what? with doing this because, um, like I said, my license is currently suspended. Okay. I'm working on a hardship. But I only live two blocks away from there. If I could, if you could Well, let's, let's see what we can do. Okay? Okay. Let's cross one bridge at a time. Let me see what the status is of your... You said it's suspended. I'm looking for what? Okay? Um, DUI. When well, did you get that? I, I completed um, everything that I need to except for I'm signed up for this 12-week program class that I haven't started yet. Okay. And um, I just finished the probation and I just need to be finished with the class and I'll be done with it. And I'm really not trying to create more trouble in my life if I have Nobody wants to create trouble, you know? I know. So let me check this. I'll be right back. Don't go nowhere. Hey, let me call you back, Mom. Any luck? Got a hold of her? Yeah. Um, for insurance-wise, I'm sorry, I just... I'll probably ask her about that. Yeah, my apologies, officer. I just moved into Cove K, so my address on there is not up to par, but I was just driving up to get some food from the food truck and heading home. So where, where are you coming from? Oh, the food truck at Oz. The food truck at Oz? Yeah. Okay. You been drinking it all tonight? No. Sure? I haven't, I haven't drank since my DUI. I'm a little bit concerned about your driving. Your eyes are bloodshot and glassy. If you'd like, you could follow me to where I'm going. I'm well, I can't follow you. You can't even have a driver's license. What, I'm going to sit and watch you violate the law? That don't make no sense. Do me a favor. Step out. I just want to make sure you're all right to drive, okay? I mean, you just said that you can't fucking drive without the license. Right, put this stuff. Don't be reaching your pockets. I'm not. I'm just my cards in there. All right, come on over here. Over here. Over. Are you sick or injured now? Uh, sick Can, and injured. When you guys kill the front lights on my car and dip down the spotlight? No, not sick or injured. Diabetic or epileptic? No. Do you use insulin or dilantin? I do not. Have any physical disabilities? <laughs> Alright, relax.
This time what I want you to do is tilt your head back, rest your eyes closed. Keep your hands out of your pockets. Gotcha. I'm just holding my glasses. Feet together. Touch your feet together. Head back, just rest your eyes closed. Don't squeeze them real tight, just rest them closed. Alright. Um, this one here is going to be a little silly, okay? I'm going to take this pen, like we looked before, going sideways. I'm going to go in circles this time, okay? As I come in circles, I'm going to do it twice. I'm going to come in and I'm going to come close. I'm not going to touch you. But I'm going to come to the bridge of your nose. I want to see if your eyes can cross, okay? Okay. You alright with that? Yeah, I just... Okay. Right? I mean, I can leave my car here in Uber from this point on, considering the suspended license thing. Because I understand you can't let someone go. Right. Under that circumstance. Alright. Well... To be honest with you, I'd like to have you do two fields of bright exercise, so I'm concerned. Have you been smoking marijuana tonight? No, I have not. Nothing? Nothing. You got my word. Alright. Um, <clears throat> can you stand with him? I'm back in there. there. I'm going to try and figure something out, yeah. yeah I did back up in that spot. Alright, can you stand over here with these deputies? Come over here, sir. Come over here. You got shoes in the car? Um, no, I came bare for it. I went just to get food and come back home. I didn't plan on doing anything else. All right. Come on over here. Um, Would you like me to leave my vehicle here? And well, you can't leave it here. This is private property. Um, I mean, if I can find where they tow it in the morning, I guess I can do it that way. Here, come on up here. Let's do this. Right here. I can have someone come pick me up. I don't know what's going to happen yet. Okay? I'd like to ask you a couple questions. Before I ask you those questions, though, I have to read your Miranda rights. It doesn't mean that you're under arrest. It just means that I want to ask you some questions and you're being detained. You're not free to leave. If you don't want to answer the questions, I'll respect that. If you do, you got another one? If you do answer my questions, I ask you to be honest, okay? So, you go. Okay. All right, you have the right to remain silent. and not answer any questions or make any statements. You understand those rights of this right here? Yeah. Having those rights of mind, you want to answer some questions? Um, um, yeah. So, you told me you haven't been drinking? Yes. You say you haven't smoked any marijuana? Correct. You feel high at all? Buzzed, drunk, nothing at all. Yeah, you think you're under the influence of any kind of intoxicant whatsoever? Yeah. All right. So to be honest with you, I'm looking for indicators of impairment. Not only alcohol, but drugs, okay? Some of the indicators I'm seeing are synonymous with marijuana use, such as dilated pupils, eyelid tremors, body tremors. You didn't have the best balance over here. Yeah, I could admit that. Um... So, when was the last time you smoked marijuana? It was not today, I can promise you that. Well, you already told me you haven't at all. Now you're saying it's not today. Oh, I've smoked marijuana before. I have a medical card. Okay. But I did, I smoked today, I didn't smoke yesterday. I haven't smoked in the last few days at all. What do you, what is the medical use of marijuana? Anxiety. And you haven't taken your anxiety pills or the marijuana? I actually haven't eaten too much lately. Same goes for the Alprazolam, it's for the same thing. Right. I haven't needed that either. Alright, I, I can't help to see what I'm seeing. Alright? The way you're driving, the physical condition, your eyes are, I mean, just dead tail giveaway. You're, you're already out for a DUI. You're not supposed to be driving because of a DUI. What was the last time? Did you take it? Was it a breath test? Was it uh, alcohol last time? No, I took a drug test uh, probably two months ago, right before I completed my probation. Well, what did you get arrested for for the last DUI, though? Drugs? Marijuana? Uh, neither, actually. Um, they never um, they never gave me as much chance as you did. They didn't offer breathalyzer or nothing. They kind of just threw me in the car, and when we got there, offered, hey, would you like to take these tests? 
And I said, if I pass, am I able to walk? And they told me, and no, I couldn't. So, but I mean, I'm through that now, and you know, I, I'm really hoping that it doesn't continue because of tonight. Right. I mean, you did what you did. So, mm -hmm. I mean, you're not supposed to be driving. Your your license is suspended for a DUI. I, I mean, you give me no choice at all, hardly. Turn around, sir. I Turn around, come on, come around. You don't want to get in more trouble by resisting, right? Turn around. What I'm going to do is I'm going to offer you a breath test. I'm going to go down to the central breath testing. I'm going to offer you a breath test. And this deputy here would like to speak to you about your marijuana use, okay? You want to cooperate with that? Yeah, I'm not trying to cause any issues. All right. How can we get mom's truck back to mom? Uh, can, can I call her? Yep. I didn't touch the moment of rolling. Nope. I'll hold it. Is there anything in the car that shouldn't be? Uh, there's no, no marijuana in there? Any marijuana in your down your pants? No. Spread your legs. Come on over here. Does your mom know where you're at? No. Where is she at? Uh, Tyrone area. Tyrone area? Yeah. Mind if I make that phone call? Yeah, yeah, have a seat. Uh, once you get in, we'll do it. Okay. I, uh, I'm, I'll work with you. I'm not going to be a dick. I'm it's, not, I, mean, I know. What are the chances that I'm actually going to see my own bed tonight? Probably none. I mean, even if it was for the driving or suspension. You're not supposed to be driving. I mean, you can't come me a small break. I was just trying to go get some food. And, you know, I've had... Just tell me. I'd rather just poke it, poke it in. You gonna be able to see? Yeah. Let me know if I can help you. Now let me have it. I'll put it on speakerphone, okay? It's not. Right. One more try. But wouldn't it be easier if you just told me? There we go. Alright, so. Push call. Is it Kira? Yeah. Alright, scoot yourself in. I'll hold it. Hey. So, I don't know, this isn't really looking good. <clears throat> I'm handcuffed right now. The officer's got my um, phone up to me. <sighs> I'm wondering if you can potentially come get my truck. I'm over, I was on the way home. I'm on the side road um, next to Cove K. Just stay on the, um, just stay on the side road. Where's the key? We'll uh, wait here for you. How long is it going to take you to get here, if you can come? Um, yeah, well, um, I've got to um, get someone to follow me so they can drive the car home. Um, I'm about 20... I'm over in St. Pete, so 20 minutes. All right, we'll try to have somebody wait here for it for 20 minutes, maybe even half an hour. But if it's going to be longer than that, I can't tie another deputy up for that long. I'd love to save you guys a tow bill, but I can't. There's other calls holding. Yeah, no. Um, Stephen, can you leave your key there? Because I don't know where the spare, the spare is. I mean, right if they now. give me a second to... We're, we're not just going to leave the car here by itself. We're going to wait here for you, okay. and we'll hand you okay. the key. Okay. But, but you got to get here like 20, 25, 30 minutes without getting in trouble for speeding. There's not even any whipped cream in here, or any kind of liquid or anything. No, it's just in the helmet. Jeez and crap. 
I think that's enough. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Still no pill bottle? Still no pill bottle. Here, put that in his wallet because that covers his booking fees. I don't know where the pill bottle he speaks of.